A large interdisciplinary team of researchers has released a cheerful report saying it's too late to limit global warming to 1.5 degrees as mandated by the Paris Agreement. The 230 pages report looked at both the physics of climate change, but also at the social changes necessary to limit warming. In their own words, they focus on plausibility, not feasibility. So unlike most other reports who settle on stating it's technologically possible, to do one thing or another, this report also considers what is socially possible. They assess the changes that have already taken place, such as moves away from the use of fossil fuels and the enacting of legalization to promote green technologies, as well as what's needed in the future to hit the targets set by the Paris Agreement. The verdict is bad news. The social drivers of decarbonization, they say, are incremental and temporary. Climate action pledges remain insufficient and uncertain and beset by financial obstacles. The report points out that it's become more difficult for nations to meet their climate targets due to the economic stress of the COVID pandemic and the consequences of the ongoing Russian invasion of Ukraine. They conclude that it's not plausible will limit warming to 1.5 degrees. They do have a little bit of good news in that they note that climate movements and lawsuits are driving social change, but in a nutshell, it's too little too late. This conclusion is depressing, but let's be honest, not particularly surprising. Indeed, I'd say it's depressing exactly because it isn't surprising. On the other hand, we're all safe on our energy bills once we can cook eggs on the pavement.